Hi Libra, this is Nayla Latrice and I am here to do a video for you to close out the year. I know, I know it has been a long few months since you have seen my face and since I have done a read for you, but um, I had to take a break and do for Nayla. There was a lot of stuff that was happening in my life at the time and I just had to take care of myself. Self-care is number one because if I'm not taken care of, then I cannot take care of you all but now i am good and i am back like i never left um and yeah if this is your first time tuning in don't let it be your last make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and also smash that like button it does help the algorithm and it helps the channel to grow okay so libra we are going to jump right into your read that way you do not have to wait any longer and oh my gosh guess what came straight out y'all and y'all feelings already damn <laughs> Is this how y'all having me come back? Y'all y'all and y'all feelings. There is a partnership that is on your mind. There is a connection that is on your mind. You are feeling all the feels right now about this person. Um, I feel like this is possibly someone you could have recently met. Doesn't have to be. But I do feel like this is somebody that you just recently met. And uh, you really, really like them. You really enjoy their company. You enjoy their time. And uh, the feeling is very mutual. So let's see what else. You could have had to cut somebody else off, though, um, before meeting this person. Or it could have taken you cutting somebody off for you to finally meet this person. I feel like, um, yeah, you are the empress. You are the empress. I feel like what I was going to say, and look what we, what we have here, the queen of swords. You definitely cut somebody off to get to where you are now. Um, I feel like you had a lot of growing that you had to do. I feel like there was a lot of transformation that you had to go through, Libra. And I feel like you made it through that uh, transformation successfully. And then you met this person. And now you are where you are with them. I feel like you guys had a beautiful Christmas together. That just came up uh, to me as well. So whoever you have met, um, you guys were able to spend Christmas together. And it was really uh, good. I feel like things are going very, very well for you right now. I feel like you or them also could be a doctor or in the medical field as well. Um, you may have met this person at work, possibly, um, but I definitely feel like uh, maybe a hospital or you guys met them in um, in a uh, healthcare setting or a healthcare facility. Um, but you guys are de things are definitely going well. I feel like you are in your empress energy. I feel like this is you right here. I feel like you know exactly who you are. Um, this could also be emperor. Energy is um is interchangeable. Um, but do know that you are in your power. You are feeling good. You are feeling loving. You are feeling warm. You are feeling sweet, and uh, you're feeling motherly. So there could be children involved as well, or you could be feeling fatherly. Um, but there are children involved. I feel. Uh, maybe some of you guys have, you know, done, done, done up. <laughs> y'all done up. <laughs> That's what they used to say back in the day, back in the 90s. Y'all did up. <laughs> maybe it was just me and where I grew up. I grew up in the Midwest, but um, like we did to do. Like we done up. Hey, but uh, and maybe uh, you're finding out that you are having a baby and that you are um, going to be expecting soon is what I am picking up as well. But I definitely feel like you are feeling like royalty. This person treats you like royalty. And that is exactly how it should be. All right, Libra, let's go. I love this read for you guys already. But I feel like you had to kiss a lot of frogs to get to where you were. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We have this three of swords. So someone has definitely broke your heart previously that you had to get through and get over. Um, and then we have the six of pentacles and this four of wands. So this lets me know that somebody um, is ready. Somebody is giving you an equal give and take relationship. But again, I feel like you had to go through a lot of heartbreak and a lot of healing Um for you to be able to get to where you are now. But now you're in an equal give and take relationship. And I feel this relationship can definitely lead to, um, to a long-term foundation for sure. Yeah, you've had to protect yourself. 
you've had to protect yourself and move away from a situation that was very, very toxic. And I feel like for some of you guys, um, this person is, you still may have to watch out for this person or not that they're going to do anything dangerous, nothing like that. Um, for some, it could be, um, I'm not picking up that energy though, but I just feel like somebody, um, you're still kind of on guard. Like if this person is going to come back or not that you're in, not that you're moving around this new relationship, being careful because of your ex, but I feel like your ex still has some type of effect on you. Um, that's making you still be maybe somewhat a little bit guarded. And I don't feel like that's for everyone. I feel like that's just for a few of you. I feel like for some of you guys, you guys are still experiencing this pain. Even if you are with somebody new and it's going well, I still feel like you still may have some of the remnants of this um the 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 relationship you were in previously that you had to cut off i feel like you are still dealing with the pain but i feel like this relationship that you are in currently is here to help continuously heal you and to show you that not all men or women are alike there somebody is doing a lot of crying someone is crying a whole lot but spirit is saying it's going to be okay you can cry there's nothing wrong with crying um you need to 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 let your um soul release but do know that um, it's part of the journey to have to cry and to um, to release and to let that go. We have the Ace of Swords. Your crown chakra is really on point right now. Um, I do feel like you are receiving many messages and also many truths. Um, I feel like a lot of things are being shown to you visually. I feel like some of you guys may have... Um, uh, your third eye activated and you guys are maybe realizing that you guys are psychic or have some type of psychic abilities and these things are being revealed to you. You also could be having a lot of dreams about this connection or just in general. It, it doesn't, it could be about complete things that have to do with the world or things that have to do with other people. But I feel like you're receiving a lot of downloads and a lot of messages just overall and in general. Uh huh. I also feel like you will be receiving clarity in regards to this situation or this relationship that you are in, this connection that you are in as well. Um, with this lovers here, I do feel um, that this is a connection that spirit is bringing together. You see how her hands are wrapped over her heart. I feel like this is something that spirit wants um, to make happen. Um, and again, you did have to walk away from some type of relationship, but I feel like you walked away towards something and you walked straight into this. Mm-hmm. That is what I am feeling for you. All right, Spirit, let's get one more card. Let's get one more card for Libras. This is absolutely amazing energy. And look what we have that flipped out. I don't need to say nothing else. Th there's a perfect match. We have the Emperor and the Empress on the board. Harry, both of you guys go. Mm-hmm. And then we have this Lovers here. And then we also have this Two of Cups. I mean, what else do you, what else needs to be said here? You guys are in love. You guys are in your feelings. This is definitely a perfect match. Again, before the emperor even came out, I said this is something that spirit is bringing together. Mm-hmm. This is absolutely amazing. Spirit wants you to know that you did a really good job. This is for somebody specific. Spirit wants you to know that you did a really good job and that you were strong enough to walk away from the previous situation and the situation that hurt you previously because now you see why Spirit was telling you to walk away. Now you are seeing why Spirit was telling you, hey, you have to leave that situation alone and you've met the reason on why you needed to leave that situation alone because now you have met the one or the person that you will be with for a very long time. Spirit is telling you, you do not have to cry anymore. Anymore. You do not have to um, put what you feel, uh, you don't have to fear anymore or feel like what other people did to you that the people are just going to keep doing that to you. Once you realize your worth, they can no longer treat you that way, baby, because you already know who you are and how you need to be treated. And if they are not treating you that way, then you're going to cut it. You know, that's our favorite thing to do. We cut it off if it's not what is conducive for you or for your growth, whether they understand that or not. It doesn't mean it doesn't hurt you, but it means that you have to cut off what does not serve you, okay? Libra, this is an absolute 
amazing read. I am really happy for you. I am really excited for you. Congratulations. Yes. This is real this is a really really good beautiful read. Um I do feel like one more thing is coming through. Whatever these downloads that you are receiving, spirit is saying that they're meant for you to also go and tell other people. So, um maybe some of you guys are readers, maybe some of you guys are tapped in spiritually or maybe you're not, but they're just messages that you're receiving in spirit is you'll come across the right people at the right time when you're supposed to share the messages that are coming through to you. Um, I had to say that before I closed out. So um, obviously there's some messages, Libra, that you guys are going to have to share with somebody um, or that you're going to have to speak up to somebody on something that is being revealed to you that you need to share with somebody else. So Libra, I am going to leave your read there. If I have said anything that has resonated with you, please let me know down below in the comment boxes. And also, if you are interested in a personal read or any of my other services that I offer, go ahead and click the link down below in the description box. And until 2021, bye Libra. And I hope you have an amazing and happy new year. Bye.